So, another subscriber request. Uh, this guy wants to know why nice guys finish last. And I think that this, I think that this is a great video topic. I think that a lot of guys understand, you know, the face value of this, why nice guys finish last, but they don't really understand, like, you know, the chemistry of it, like why it really is what it is. And let's get into that real quick, guys. Notice first and foremost that nice guys finish last, but guess what? They still finish. They still gonna finish. And, and the reason that is, is because pussy has a time value. I'll tell you this here right now, pussy has a time value. So that's why nice guys finish last, because women go through phases of when they're in their whole stage, when they're looking for a guy to, to marry, when they're looking for a uh, post that, when after the marriage, or if there is, they're gonna be looking for, you know, they might be back in their whole stage. So women go through different phases. One thing about us men and why we have it better is because as we progress, as we get older, we we don't really, we don't decline. You know, from the if you keep yourself healthy, guys, if you maintain, you know, staying in the gym and stuff, keeping your body healthy, staying, uh, you know, good looking, well groomed, all that kind of stuff, and you're working on your passion and you're trying to be successful, you're only going to skyrocket. If you're in your 20s here, you're only going to continue to go up. So a woman in her 20s obviously is at her peak because we as men see them as sexual objects. It is what it is. Let's be real here. They're going to be, you know, at their top 20 all the way to or 18, 17 all the way to, you know, whatever, early 30s if they stay on top, stay on point. But at the eh, mid 30s, they start dropping off. They start dropping off. That's when they settle for the nice guy. That's when they're looking for, okay, who's going to be the provider for me? Who's going to be the man to take care of me when my looks go, when this pussy ain't as tight? That's when the nice guy finishes last. In that whole meantime, though, they're looking for the highest value male. They're looking guy, for guys to drop a dick off. I'm calling it right now, dropping dick off 2019. That's when they're looking out for those guys. All through that whole 20 to or 18 to about mid 30 phase, if they stay good looking, if they don't really take care of themselves, it's probably just going to be strictly 18 to their 20s, and that'll be it. Most women, but some women can you know push that all the way to their 30s. Good for them. I will be digging you down, but in general, guys, the nice guy isn't going to get the play that he wants when they're at their prime, which is why, again, they say nice guys finish last. So I guess the, the real question here is why don't women want to fuck nice guys? The, the issue here is that nice guys do not spark that. They don't spark that thing out of women. They don't. They're too busy in trying to claim, you know, some kind of. They're too busy in trying to uh, show themselves as some kind of guy, some kind of provider to be what they need instead of being what they want. It's a difference between being something that a woman needs and being something that a woman wants. Because if she needs this, this could not just be the right time. She could be 24, 25 years old. She might need a guy in the end to take care of her, but she doesn't want that right now. What she wants is a guy to dick her down. That's that's That might be her phase right there. She might still be in her whole phase. So she's not looking for a nice guy to come in and swoop in and take care of her. She's looking for a bad boy to come in and drop some dick off. She's not looking for that. Okay? That's not what the game plan is. That's not her game plan. Nice guys get caught up in here's a flower, here's this, here's that, which is crazy because, you know, I actually was talking to a chick I had over, right? So... We're talking about a mutual friend that was at my job previously. How her boyfriend would always send her flowers, a bouquet of flowers every Wednesday. Typical nice guy. I met this guy, he's a nice guy. Upstanding guy, nice guy. Sent her flowers every Wednesday. At first, it was like, wow, you know, all the coworkers were like, oh, wow, he sent you flowers, it's great, so romantic. All and the whole time I'm like, ah, oh, it's good. It's, you know, that's what's up for him, that's great. But what I noticed was even, you know, as weeks went by, every Wednesday, you get the same bouquet of flowers every Wednesday. And 
you know, then it came to a point where I think I came, but I was like, oh, you got flowers or whatever. And she was like, yeah, you know, he sent them. Yeah, he sends these every, every blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, wow. You could tell in her voice that she didn't appreciate it at all. And I had mentioned that. And then the girl was talking to me like, oh, no, that's not true. If you did this, if you did that, I said, no, 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 no. Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. I said, if I came to you every time you came over to my crib, every time you came over to my crib, if I presented you with a rose every single time you came, you coming over once a week and I present you a flower. If I did that, after a while, you would not value it that much. As much as the first time, you would not value it. And she was going back and forth, she was arguing. I was like, ah, I'm not hearing none of that. At the end of the day, if I gave you a flower, that first time you'd be like, wow, that's amazing. But after a while, it start getting old. You're gonna start to think that, you're gonna start expecting a flower. That's a woman's nature right there. They will start expecting a flower. Because I guarantee you, if you stopped it after a while, they'd be like, where's my flower? I, you're supposed to give me a flower every, see how, see, do you see why that is? That's why nice guys finish last. Because they don't understand a woman's nature. Women like conflict. Women like, you know, something that's not ordinary. Women like a, a, a skewed path. They don't like things that just go in a straight line. Guys, we think straightforward. We think logically. We're like, yo, we get it from point A to point B. We're going straight there. Women want to go from point A to point B. They want us to be an adventure everywhere they go. I want to stop over here and go around here, go here. Then we'll end up at point B. How much better was that? That's a woman's thinking. That's a woman's mentality. So that's why nice guys finish last. They're too much, they're too focused in, you know, just this general thing of girl meets boy, boy likes girl, he he confesses to her, he presents her with flowers, he treats her like a queen, he lays out the red carpet, throws out his coat around her, pulls open the door, stuck in this fantasy of that stuff and women have gotten so desensitized to that kind of stuff women are tired of that shit but they don't want to admit it really at the end of the day but i you know i guess i can't blame them because they're they're going to want to suck out whatever whatever material objects they can get out of you and then just drop you off that that's what a lot of women do women i i see it all the time i've been with a chick and she's been like you know supposed to have a date with a guy that night, but she was at my crib. And then she was like, uh, you know, messaging this guy, letting me know. And then I'm just chilling there like, uh, what? Uh, I'm just chilling there. And then she's like, uh, you know, he was telling her, well, are you gonna be, you know, on time to the date? Are you gonna flake type shit? And you know, that kind of lets her know that, okay, this guy, he's used to not having girls show up on dates. He's used to girls flaking on him. So, you know, in her mind, she's like, that's sad, you know, but guess what? She still stayed with me that night. She, she still ended up flaking on the guy and I guarantee you she didn't feel bad about it. I guarantee you, nice guys, you don't put out all your cards. You don't lay all your cards out on the table. That's pretty much what nice guys do. They lay all their cards out on the table and they, here's what I got. Do you like it? What can I do to improve it more? This and that. Like, that's what a nice guy does. Instead of just being like, okay, well, here's one card. In order to see the rest of my hand, you gotta come through and, you know, this and that. We gotta get things cracking if you wanna see the rest of my hand. You know, that type of thing. It's really a shame if you think about it because you would think that in a perfect world, a woman would appreciate a guy that's really into them that really cares about them, that would tell them that they're beautiful, send them good morning texts every morning. It's, it doesn't work, guys. It just turns them, it eventually turns them off. They think in a totally different way than we do. There's nothing we can do about it. It's a shame, but at the same time, you have to accept it as women nature and keep it moving. You have to accept it as women nature and keep that shit moving. Nice guys get caught up in multiple dates where they're literally taking chicks out to dinner and the girls are just using them, flaking on other guys and doing all this and that. They don't respect a nice guy. They will take a nice guy for granted. They won't appreciate him. They will just see him as a tool for resources. That is it. 
until they reach the stage of where the value of their vagina, the value of their looks perishes, and then they're faced with an ultimatum. I have to settle down with a provider, with a guy that's gonna be there for me and not cheat on me and all this kind of stuff. Those are the two implications there. A woman's either gonna settle for the provider or the beta nice guy at the end, you know, at the resolution of her pussy career, or she's just gonna settle for that guy. She's gonna finish off with the nice guy after she done got ran through by a bunch of real dudes that just about their business, AKA alphas. And they're tired of all the games, they're tired of getting cheated on, they're tired of getting messed with. That's when they settle for the nice guy. Why the hell you want to use goods, nice guy? Fuck that. Anyways, guys, I appreciate all the support. Um, this was a subscriber request. Good question. I appreciate all the requests, guys. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. Turn on those notifications. All going to keep grinding out here. We all going to make ourselves higher value. I hope that this helps out a lot of people. Y'all be easy. Deuces. Deuces.